Welcome back to my channel. In case you don't already know, my name is Ashley and today is Thursday. So that means it's time for another coffee date Thursday. So I don't have a fancy mug with me this week. I just have this boring old plastic cup. I had some like pre-brewed iced green tea. So that's just what I'm drinking today. And as you can see, I have no makeup on. So I probably look kind of crazy. I don't know what this is gonna look like on camera. But I went to the gym this morning and I really try my hardest not to wear makeup to the gym because with all the sweating and it just makes your skin, well first of all it's not good for your skin. Second of all, you can end up looking like a hot mess <laughs> walking out of the gym with a full face of makeup after working out hard and going in the sauna. Yeah, that's, that's not pretty. And then also, I wasn't going to put makeup on because after I do this I'm going to film a DIY peel off face mask. So I don't want makeup on for that. And I didn't want to film this after that because my face is probably going to be a little red from doing that. So I mean, not like you guys needed to know all that, but whatever. This week's topic is January favorites. So I'm just gonna get right into it. The first product that I have is this lip balm. This is from Arrow. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of this brand, if you get Birchbox at all, um, they use Aero products and this is actually where I found this company. I really like them because they're more environmentally friendly. They typically have a lot of vegan products and products that just you know have a lot less chemically junk like a lot of other companies put in theirs. But this is a color enhancing lip balm. And since it is so dry and so cold outside, my lips get chapped a lot. So I'm always putting something on my lips, but not like lipstick because my lips are dry and lipstick just seems to dry them out even more. So what's nice about this is it gives you a hint of color so you don't look like you're not wearing anything. I have it on right now, a little extra on. And it's nice because it gives you a little hint of color and it also moisturizes, so this is one of my favorite products, especially for the winter. I mean, I use this all year long though, but it's really great in the winter. Uh, next is this shampoo. This is from number four, that is the brand name, and it is their clarifying shampoo. This is my absolute favorite. I also found this through Birchbox. I got a little bit, a little sample from them. It just like transformed my scalp, which sounds funny, but yeah, that's important. Important business there. You know, I have a nice, clean, flake free scalp. And this stuff just did wonders. Um, and I know. Like a lot of stylists say, oh, you're not supposed to use clarifying shampoos on color treated hair because it'll strip your color out, blah, blah, blah. And when my stylist told me that, like how we even got on this topic was she was like, oh my gosh, your scalp is so healthy. What have you been doing to it? And I'm like, oh, I've been using this shampoo. And she's like, oh, it's clarifying. Well, you're really not supposed to use this, blah, blah, blah. So I looked into it and the company actually says that it is safe on color treated hair. And just from personal experience, I've never had any issue with my color fading or getting taken out any quicker because of the shampoo. So I highly recommend this. It is also 100% vegan, gluten-free, sulfate and sodium chloride-free, paraben-free. So very, very nice. Next product, sticking with the hair theme, is actually for kids. This is from Nature Babies Organic. It is a leave-in. Well, it's a conditioner and detangler, but you can leave it in or rinse it out. And this is vanilla tangerine. It is also free of SLS, parabens, glutens, and it is hypoallergenic, which is nice. I use this for both of my younger girls and I absolutely love it. It's nice to have that option to rinse out or leave in. So I usually put this in while they're playing and I let them play in the bath. And sometimes we rinse it out, sometimes we don't. Um, with Grace, I usually rinse out, but Victoria, 
most of the time we leave it in because if any of you know my toddler, she has extremely curly hair and it gets really, really tangly. And this stuff is a godsend and it makes their hair smell really nice. I love the scent. Uh, next thing that I have goes back to the dry cold weather making my skin feel disgusting. It feels like I'm some kind of reptile with some nasty scaly skin. So I turn to my trusty Clarisonic. This thing does wonders for your skin if you have never used one. And it helps with the dryness so much and it leaves my skin feeling so much softer than it did before. And I even notice like when I do put on makeup, like a foundation or a BB cream or anything, it goes on so much smoother after I use this than it otherwise would. So, and I know there's a bunch of knockoffs on the market that aren't as expensive as a Clarisonic, but I highly suggest these. I've had this one for a couple of years now and it works great. I've never had an issue with it. So, yeah, I love my Clarisonic. And then my last January favorite is actually something that I make myself. It is an anti-acne face toner. And as you can see, my bottle's empty because I need to make more. I love this stuff because it is gentle. It doesn't uh, irritate or burn. You know exactly what goes into it. And it really helps to fight acne. I use this, my oldest daughter uses it, I've made some and given it to various friends and they've all really liked it. So this is another favorite of mine. I do have a video on making this as well. So I'll leave that link down below if you guys want to check it out. And I'll go ahead and leave some links on where you can find some of these products too because I highly recommend them. So this is everything that I'm loving for the month of January and really all year round. If you guys have any questions, feel free to leave them below. I will definitely answer them. And I'm also gonna leave the play link for the other ladies that are participating so you can check out what their favorites are too. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you again next time. Bye.